the next thing that makes you a loser is if you treat other people poorly, right? You do you do bad things to people, right? I, I'm the firm believer of, of respect is due to everybody and you should treat everybody good. Everybody should treat everybody good, right? Now, if a motherfucker get out of line, you got to handle your business. Smash them, right? But, you know, you treat everybody good. You treat people good, you know, especially people who deserve it, you know? Um, but if you treat other people poorly, you're a loser because people don't deserve to be treated like that, especially if people who haven't done anything to you. Now, again, if somebody get out of line, somebody do something to you, you got to handle your business. Do whatever you feel like you need to do, whether it's smash them or get them out of your life or whatever the case may be. Right. But but going around treating other people poorly, it's just it's sucker shit is loser shit, because what do you get out of treating people poorly? Right. It makes you feel better. It makes you feel better about yourself. That you treat other people poorly. That's how much of a loser you are. And you losing in everything else. That the only satisfaction that you give. That you get in this life. Is inflicting some type of, type of turmoil or pain. Onto other people. Makes you a loser. You're a piece of shit. Right? You're a piece of shit. You inflicting pain on somebody. Or misery. Or, misery or confusion. Or chaos. If that makes you happy. If that gives you. Whatever it gives you. You're a loser, right? It's like a level of trolling. Trolling is loser shit, right? When you see these people trolling and leaving negative comments online on people's shit just to make people feel bad, if you click on their profiles, it's always people that's clearly losers. I've never, ever seen Gary V or fucking Russell Branson or fucking uh, any successful person, Elon Musk, um, Mark Zuckerberg, uh, who else? Just name him. P. Diddy. Well, not P. Diddy. I can't. Even, let me leave his name off of here. Uh, you know, anybody. Jay Z. I've never seen successful people in nobody's comments trolling. Ever. Never. People make jokes. Cool. But trolling or saying negative things to make people feel bad. I've never seen that. A lot of your favorite content creators are losers. No matter how much it seems they win and they losers have loser mentalities you know like y'all be like roast this or roast single mothers or roast fat for what what the fuck am i gonna get out of that i don't get nothing out of that that makes you feel good to see somebody else get roasted or or or, or to be shamed like i don't get nothing out of that that's a waste of motherfucking space and time and energy for me to do that because i don't get anything out of that you see what i'm saying i don't not that I don't know what people get out of it. They get happiness out of it because that's they basically projecting onto other people how they feel about themselves. They're projecting their failures onto other people. Right? And if you do that, you're a fucking loser. Period. Right? Man, go go do this homework assignment. Just read the comments. Every video you scroll in, read, start reading the comments. And if you see a successful person being negative, tearing somebody down, screenshot and let me know. I send you five hundred dollars. Losers do that, trolling and causing confusion and 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 you know just treating other people poorly. And that's just not online. That's in real life. When you treat when you treat women poorly, you're a loser. You are. I don't care. When women treat you poorly, they're losers. If you have a woman and you treat her poorly, you are a loser. If 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 your woman is treating you poorly, she's a fucking loser. Especially if you don't deserve it. She's a loser. If your woman is cheating and being disrespectful, she is a fucking loser. She's a bad character loser, period. And if you doing that to anybody, you a loser. You don't have to like what I'm saying. And it's some little game too. Some game real quick. Always pay attention to the way a woman treats other people. Pay attention. Y'all be anti-dates, but take these women on dates sometimes. Take them to Hooters and shit. Which is, Hooters is a gold mine. Y'all don't even know about Hooters. I don't even know if I'm ready to let that secret out yet. But outside of they'd have the best fucking wings ever. But Hooters is like the best, best date spot, by the way. Um, but yeah, take, take them to Hooters. Take them to, a, you know... To where they gotta interact and, and just watch how she treat people. You know, watch how if she rude, 
you know, and just because a woman is speaking soft don't mean she's not rude. You know, don't mean her tone is whatever, because a, a lot of women hide that nastiness behind femininity, behind being feminine and soft and fucking passive aggressive and shit. You know, but just pay attention to the way that she treat people. And if she treat people poorly, she's a piece of shit. You know, she's a loser. So that's what makes you a loser. If you treat other people poorly, the, the, the key to life, man, is to always treat people the way that you want to be treated. That's my key. Treat people the way that you want to be treated and you'd be a 